All right, guys, we're back. We are back. Here we are. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah, we had just advanced to Imperial Age. So... Let's get... War Galley, which I guess we can do now. Also gonna grab Conscription. And Plate Mail. Where, why are you guys coming under that way? I don't know. Oh yeah, um, also I think we have reached a point of stability where Alexios can go back to his castle. Enjoy the nice life of uh, Emperor. For some reason they have careening but not war galley. Of course we are Byzantine so we're gonna get the better fire ships. Alright, so we should be getting taxes soon. And we have 100 legitimacy. We are too legit to quit. So we maintained the legitimacy. Now we have to defeat the Turks and the Normans. The Normie Normans. The eunuch doesn't have anything for me right now. Did I ever get ballistics? No, I did not. And Strategos doesn't have anything for me, and I still have to find some relics, and then maybe defeat the Fatimids. Emph so, oh, what? A Turk named Cha Chakas claims your throne and, and has mobilized an army of Turks against you at Smyrna. Kill him before he becomes an even greater threat. Well, that's pretty indicative of what I should do. Seer's taxes have been collected. Hooray! What? A particularly arrogant eunuch has taken to beating his male servants. A passing monk attempted to stop him, but was also struck by the eunuch. So much scandal. Stop it. Stop doing scandal. Stop doing scandal. I'm very eloquent. Looks like uh, my ship's got sank. Uh, let's get a couple of trebs and move on, uh, whoever the pretender is. Is he a hero? Ah, yes, Chakas. Well, let's get some more... Well, let's first get that. Let's get a few more Varangans. Hey, why am I under attack? Oh, I think it's just... Yeah. Just a few galleys. Wait, where'd, where'd I put the other transport? Am I being really dumb? I feel like I'm being really dumb. Oh, there's a monk over here. That's why hitting your idle military hotkey occasionally is a good idea. Uh, we'll leave the rams over here just because they're slow. So yeah, hopefully this will be enough. Um, I mean, my Vrangians are pretty awesome. They have 112 HP. It seems like the uh, the Balkans, at least south of the Danube, are pretty pretty set right now. 
Well, actually, speaking of the Danube, um, didn't they say the Pechenegs are going to migrate or something? Wait, where does it say about? Okay, to the northwest, the River Danube marks the Roman frontier. Beyond the river are the Pechenegs step nomads who fight as Tarkins and Kipchaks. Uh, though the river barricades keep the Pe Pechenegs at bay, a mass migration of these people will quickly threaten Byzantine lands. Okay, I feel like they're going to alert me at some point in saying, Oh no, the barricades have fallen! The Pechenegs are swarming us everywhere! And we'll have to fight... I don't know. Uh, what did they say? Tarkins and Kipchaks? We'll probably have to fight some Tarkins and Kipchaks. Hopefully not too many. What's under attack? Also, I hope this isn't on a timer. It didn't really say... Oh, that that's a friendly castle. Great. I didn't even need to bring the trebuchets. Oh, I never got arson. Um, let's just scooch on in. That mangonel, uh, those mangonels are probably dealing more friendly fire than, uh, you know, damage to us. Oh crap, now we have no way of getting out. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Um, booby rebels retreat to the shadows. Okay, I guess that's good. And our legitimacy is back up, so that's good. Can I, like, take the city, too? Because that'd be pretty sick. If I, like, defeat all the units garrisoned. Um, I guess not. Yeah, probably not. Let's just not take any more damage. Be nice to have a, a city over here, though. Okay, so, do we ever, ugh, have you ever found any relics? Because I don't see any. Everyone else is still in Castle Age, which is really good. Taxes! Also, there's some sort of, like, way of mitigating inflation that the game is using. I don't know what it is. Oh, no, I did get Blast Furnace. Yeah, it looks like we can't get Galleon at all. Alas. Now the question is, should we make stuff other than these Rangans? Oh wait, no! Warren Lou. Byzantines don't get Blast Furnace. Boo! One of the three civs in the game, I think. Wait. Byzantines, Koreans, Vietnamese, Malians. Now there are four. Yeah, these attacks are pretty pitiful, if I do say so. Oh, rip, one berserk is left behind. Oh, what? Retender named Nikephoros Diogenes controls the Isle of Crete and has made an alliance with the rebel in Cyprus. Taking both islands will strengthen your legitimacy. Well, that sounds good. Uh, Crete is way down here, south of Greece, and Cyprus is further along the coast. So we have to conquer both of them. We have some fire ships. Honestly, I kind of want to get a few more fire ships. Also, I kind of want to get dry dock, just because I don't want to have to ferry people back and forth. Uh, the men on the Danube frontier say the Pechenegs are on the move. Oh. Big yikes. Um. Okay. Prepare for the Pechenegg invasion. 
So although conquering Crete and Cyprus will help my legitimacy, not losing the entire Roman Empire will probably help it even more. So how many of these guys are there exactly? Prepare for the Pechne... Oh, prepare for the Pechneg invasion. Um... So I assume they'll be coming across these bridges. But are they still intact for now? Okay, so they are intact for now. How do I prepare? They fight as Tarkins and Skirmishers, or Kipchaks. I only have a few barracks. I guess I should make some Legionaries because they're pretty good. I don't know what else I should make necessarily. I guess I should also make some pikemen. Uh oh. You can only hold back their tide. You can only hold back their tide by building fortifications along the Danube. Oh, they want me to build fortifications? Yeah, these guys are pretty dope. Uh, arguing over dice game brawled in the streets and accidentally struck a senator. Ungrateful bastards. So, I guess we need to build some fortifications to defend Rome, or not Rome, Constantinople. Yep, we're the other Roman Empire. Well, this is rather pitiful. Okay, good. Taxes. Uh, let's get guard tower. Probably should get Bracer. Oh, wait, I can get Keep too, right? Yeah, yeah, so 500, 350. Hitting all the wrong buttons. The Pechenegs have literally done nothing so far, so I'm pretty terrified. Maybe this is just going to be all for nothing, and I should have already gone uh, to take Cret, Crete, Crete, however you pronounce it. But, uh, you know, rather safe than sorry, right? So yeah, these guys, oh, they don't even have loom. You can't even give me loom, man. <laughs> I wonder when they arrive. Well, we have some keeps. Of course, Byzantine HP bonus is nice. I wonder how long Dyrrachium will continue to give us tribute when it's slowly being leveled by the Normans. Whoa, 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 wait. I didn't know these guys uh, transported. 
Um, I wish I could get ballistics. Well, I mean, you can get ballistics, I just can't afford it right now. Yo, petchin' eggs. Come at me, bro. You're only in feudal age. What's the worst that could happen? Famous last words. Let's bring the villagers back. Just because they don't even have loom, man. Like, again, the... Oh. Um... Um... Sorry about that. Anyway, um... Okay. We did, you know, silver linings, everybody. We did not uh, over-prepare. Bad news, we probably under-prepared. <laughs> okay, they only have plus... Well, wait, the Kipchoks are a little bit better upgraded, but the Tarkins only have plus one, plus one. Gate Vert? I don't know what that means. Green? Oh, how, how helpful are the keeps? Probably not helpful enough. Oh boy, now is the uh, the winter of our discontent, am I right? Oh, hopefully this will keep the, the keeps, will, you know, keep them at bay for a little while. Oh, never mind, what am I talking about? Gate there. Um, you guys can take them. You guys can take them easy peasy. Honestly, we're doing better than I thought. Okay. Um, let's get some more legionaries too. Some pikemen, I guess. We need something. Holy crap, man. That's a lot of Kipchaks. And of course, there are still, like, some Tarkins left that are going to be working away at these keeps. Okie dokie. Well, um, we're going to have like 12 units. That's okay. That's all you need, right? Oh, wait, are they running away? Oh, if they're splitting up, maybe we can divide and conquer them. Of course, I had to play this, like, just after Kipchok's got a buff. They still are very low HP. It's just there's so goddamn many of them. Oh yeah, rip that game plan. Hmm. Do I have another university? Okay, we have another university somewhere. Because we can't replace buildings. At least I don't think. Yeah, we can only build fortifications. So I'm just going to fast forward this until we get more stuff. 
because we need more stuff. What happens if they control the Hagia Sophia? It is a monument. Okay. Only 2k. Let's get that. Unfortunately, like, we're so limited by our production buildings. At least they're idiots. And just attacking walls. Oh, what have I done? You skirmisher. Oh my god. What have I done? Oh, that's what happens when the Hagia Sophia is, is taken. Try, try again. Okay, let's do this again. Now we just know that we need to prepare better. Hmm. I wonder... Knowing what's kind of becoming in advance, what's the best answer to Kipchak plus um, Tarkin? I guess just Halb Skirm, but that's a lot of upgrades to get to. I guess I should, though. I also need some defensive upgrades. Yeah, but I, I'm going to need to spend a good amount of uh, time and money doing this. Okay. Sorry about that. But uh, I don't think I really missed a whole lot in this particular scenario. Okay. E skirm. Pikemen. Yeah, like the big problem here is that we need to, like, sort of front load these units because they're gonna be really. It's gonna be too slow to produce them. Because I only have the, the one range. Well, I guess I could send units all the way over from Durakium and uh, Thessaloniki. Uh, Thessaloniki is actually pretty reasonable. Let's let's do that. Uh, do I have a barracks there? No, that's all the way down in Sparta. Okay, I do have one in Thessaloniki. More tax income, revenue, whatever.
But yeah, I just have so many upgrades, man. And buying stone. No bueno. Oh, uh, I have an army somewhere, don't I? Oh, you know what? Let's go looking for some relics. I have just enough for one more fire ship. Oh, wait! Guys, that was the easiest relic search of my life! Yeah, I'll just wait for next year's taxes. Try and get some more upgrades, do all that stuff. Because... Clearly, I need to take the pitch and eggs more seriously. Oh, wow, I've already lost almost all of my ships. And now all of them. Oh, no. Well, that could have gone better. Unfortunately, I don't think there are any in the mainland. So I assume the Normans and the Franks, who, or sorry, the Normans and the Franks, the Normans are Franks. The Normans and the Seljuks, uh, they get to Imperial Age and they just seem to be our main actual enemies, you know, like the, the bad guys. I think the Fatimids just kind of stand around here and don't do anything. Um, and the Petronags, you know, it's like a one and done deal. And then there are the pretenders that pop up here and there. And I, yeah, I brought Alexi back already. Or Alexios, not Alexi. It's not the Russian. Okay, let's just speed things up a little bit. Oh, it's just the peasants. I wonder how many years we have. Oh, here comes the Norman fleet! Are they imp yet? Nope. Also, screw this particular fortified wall piece in particular. Yeah, not a big fan of the whole waiting mechanic. Okay, here we go. Five points from Gryffindor! Oh, I need ballistics, definitely. I should probably focus the towers, like, around here. Probably still want to put one down there. Yeah, the Petronegs are on the move. Hopefully I'll have one more year of tax revenue, I guess. Guess might as well start the uh, good old Spamarino. Byzantines, of course, with the cheap trash. But it's kind of weird because... Uh... Oh, yep, nope, they're coming. They're definitely coming. Yeah, let's get one more tower. 
Well, we can afford exactly one more tower. Yeah, the fact that these gates are super weak is a problem. Okay, let's slow this back down. Let's get keep. Get one more tower. Oh, I never got conscription. That's a big one. The thing about conscription is like getting a better version of the Goth, Britain, and Hun team bonuses in one, as well as Kazba, the uh, Berber unique tech that lets your castles work faster. It's like getting all of those in one tech that's just 150, 150. If I had like a bunch of archers to garrison the towers, that'd be sick, but uh, no such luck, I'm afraid. Did I get chemistry? Yeah, I did. Still would like to have some more blacksmith techs. But what can you do? Well, now I guess we just need to wait, because we can't really spend anything else. Is my monk still down there? Yeah. Yes, we need to be 100% focused on the Petchen Eggs. Yeah, Normans and Turks made it to Imperial Age. I don't really know when. But their, their attacks are pretty meh. Unless you're in Durakium, then you're just kind of screwed. Okay, here they come. I think. Oh, you bet. Why aren't they making horsey sounds? That's weird. Anyway, insert 300 quotes. See, it's 30, it's 300. The same, I don't know, number, sort of, kind of. You have some keeps. I think if we can, <laughs> if we can last till spring, we might stand a bit of a better chance. Because we, we have keeps with uh, plus four, which is pretty nice. They only have plus one armor. God, that's so many. I really don't care about my legitimacy right now. Sorry. Well, most of the Tarkins are dead. Okay, sick, sick. You know what? I might need to, uh... Give up these keeps. Well, I guess that choice was made for me. There are still a few Tarkins left. But just get use it as maybe just enough time to get these Skirms and Halbs out that I need. Oh, 
Oh yeah, there's another keep over here. I forgot. Skirms can deal with the Kipchoks. We even outrange them. Yeah, the Kipchoks really aren't too big of a deal. Oh, whoops. The problem is the Tarkins and the fact that they can uh, destroy the buildings. Looks like with high ground, you can actually deal damage to these guys. No, oh, that's still a fair amount of Tarkins left. The Keeps are still buying us a lot of time, though. This is actually a really sick position for these skirmishers. And here they come. I need to do something differently. What is it that I need to do differently? It's just like I need more of everything. Need more upgrades, more units, more defensive structures. Start making some now, why not? Okay, taxes are in. Oh, curse the elite skirmisher nerf. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. Let's try this. Let's go Arbs instead of Skirms, and still go for the Halbs. No, the armor isn't important if I'm just going for the Arbs. Unfortunate distribution there. Whatever, oh, I need to get uh, conscription again. Let's get a Mern of Monk just to heal everyone up who needs it. I 
We got this, guys. We got this. It's just... It's hard, you know? It, it takes a takes a few tries. Wait... One sec, guys, sorry. Hey guys, so uh, I know that's not the most natural uh, break in the world, but uh, as it happens, uh, this is Ornlu from the future, and uh, I've, I've, I've completed the scenario, don't, don't worry, but the way I need to break it up uh, to make at least fairly consistent length segments, I guess, uh, I'm going to have to end the second part right here, and then uh, tomorrow's video will be uh, the grand finale, as they say. So yeah, uh, see you guys uh, next time for that.